Pennsylvania rifle season opener. <coughs> Sitting here on the ground. I already heard deer running around. Heard a buck grunting, chasing does. Hopefully it's a good morning. Good luck to everybody going out. I'm gonna start paying attention here. We're almost, we're almost at legal shooting light. And I'm hearing shots already. But you know how it goes if you live in Pennsylvania. And if you've been out during the Pennsylvania rifle opener. <coughs> this year, you can shoot buck or doe the first week. It's gonna be a war zone everywhere. Hopefully we get some good footage. Stay tuned to here on We Could Reach Outdoors. right now. Oh, that was a nice buck. That was a nice buck. Nice buck. Oh, come on, camera. Oh, 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 oh. I, I, was, I was sitting here and uh, uh, it was crazy. Uh, I kept hearing something, but I wasn't sure what was going on. And, oh, there's a hollow here. And I did a couple grunts, like that. <clears throat> that was my first buck in a long time. First buck in a long time. I got a text from my dad. Oh, this, <clears throat> this is what it's all about. Yeah, he, I mean, he was 30 or 40 yards, maybe. I, I hope I got decent footage of him. Like I was saying, I just grunted, sat and waited a while, nothing, so I'm just sitting here chilling, and then it got quiet again, and I decided to do a couple more grunts, and boom, up out of the hollow he came, I saw him out in front of me, I'm like, holy crap, I'm trying to get the camera, and he's like 60, 70 yards, like the whole time, and then he cut up around me, and then boom, right there, and I put the camera where he was gonna walk into. Boom. And that was all. Oh, oh. I love it. I love it. I love it. I wish I would have caught one with my bow this year, but rifle season came around. Okay, guys, stay tuned. I'm gonna get a hold of Dad and see what he wants to do. And Looks like he's been fighting. I'm glad he still has this side. I knew he was ready to go. As soon as he came up over the hill, I knew what was gonna happen. I seen now these three, because he came, he seen how he come up. I saw these three up, and I'm like, buddy, you made a mistake. Oh, this is awesome. He's, he's kind of a smaller body deer, but I think that's, I mean, his neck's, it's not super fat, but it's a little bit fat. 
and uh, I think he's been chasing some doe hard and I think he's been fighting a little bit because these are these two top ones here off the main beam they're chewed up I mean you can see how how tall these ones are and these ones are chewed off but buddy I thank you it's not it's not all about killing but when you get the opportunity to do it um and you can provide for yourself a little bit it's a good thing and he's gonna be meat on the table and I thank him for his sacrifice <laughs> he's I guess he is pretty big but um like I think he's been running a lot and he's you know how they say that they lose so much of their body weight during a rut but I'm happy with it oh, awesome stuff here on Wicked Ridge Outdoors alrighty just got back to the car I'm gonna go get dad's truck come back and load up a good old boy mom came back and helped me out a little bit because dad's sitting in a stand and I didn't really want him to get down so we're gonna go get the truck load it up and I'm taking it to my local processor stay tuned here on Wicked Ridge Outdoors okay guys you ain't gonna believe this dad just shot one too we were loading up getting ready to come out and I was I was